I'm learning about carpal tunnel syndrome. And for that, I learned about the median nerve. And from Wikipedia article, I learned that the median nerve is the only one that passes through the carpal tunnel. So I have a nice item based on close deletion. I have nice features. But the items looks a bit complex. I was wondering if I could use artificial intelligence to improve the formulation. I like to use Copilot. It provides nice, well phrased, educated answers on most topics with lovely references. Let's see how it copes. Uh, ask a question using 20 rules of formulating knowledge. Please refactor the following text to change it into a simple question for the use with spaced repetition. And here I'll paste my question about the median nerve. Let's see how it copes. What is the origin and significance of the median nerve in relation to the brachial plexus carpal tunnel syndrome? Wow, well, it's not exactly what I'm asking about. Let's try Gemini. The answer is, what nerve originates from both the lateral and medial cords of the brachial, brachial plexus and travels through the carpal tunnel? How about ChatGPT? Which nerve passes through the carpal tunnel can be affected by carpal tunnel syndrome. Wow. Well, I tried it again, and I got an even better item. What's the only nerve that passes through the carpal tunnel? That's genius. I think I'll use that to super memo. Oh, well. I see it's not exactly the answer. It's the only nerve. They were asking about the carpal tunnel. Yeah, some almost got fooled. The question looks so nice that I thought it's correct, but what's still the nerve that passes through the carpal tunnel? Median nerve, not carpal. Let's see if we can ask follow-up questions to artificial intelligence and see if it can cope better with a follow-up. Because ChatGPT is so nice and concise, I'll ask, nice and short. But I was asking about the adjective carpal, not about the median nerve. Let's see what it says. Which nerve passes through the tunnel associated with the adjective? Oh, man. You're supposed to be smart. Okay, I give up. Let's take it and move it to Gemini. Or is it Gemini? You're right, that was off topic. There was a reformulated question focusing on carpal. What does carpal for? Oh no, that's sad, that's really sad, because I have great, great respect for artificial intelligence, the progress, actually, I believe Turing test has been passed, but not in reference to learning and close deletion, no. Okay, Bing, let's see if you can cope. My apologies for the oversight. The adjective carpal relates to carpus or wristbone. What does, no, 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 it seems artificial intelligence doesn't understand close deletion. Okay, so we need to wait a little bit longer.